Hello everybody and welcome back to Tiny Worlds. We are playing as the ninja trained in the ancient arts of espionage. This ninja moves unseen with strike striking from the darkness with lethal precision. On dash they summon shadow clones, shadow clone companions for 8 seconds and uh, you turn in their skill is to turn intangible, mark enemies protecting them, taking damage when the skill ends. So let's see how that one works. I'm thinking it's like, I think it's Dark Judas from, uh, from Binding of Isaac. Get him. Cool. Okay, first level up. We like, we like it, we like Dex. Soul Hearts. Puppy! Increased buff effect. Does it, what do our Shadow Clones give us? Magic Shadow Clone, Rain Shadow Clone, each gives lethal hit chance. Okay, cool. Critical hit chance, lethal hit chance. Why is it critical? Okay. And... Yep, okay. Let's go for... Explosion. Nah, let's go, let's be well. Grenade throw... Uh, lucky hit chance. Let's go for lucky hit chance. That's always a good start to a run. Alright, intelligence. Alright, let's see. Can I... Okay, nope. There we go. Now it's active. Yep, there we go. We started with two soul hearts and I threw one away. There's my little friends. Alright, let's go for some bombs early. Bombs early is good. Nice. Uh, some early gold or more decks early? More decks early, I reckon. Right, so there is quite a long... I thought it would just activate immediately. There was quite a long delay on you starting it. And then you go. Well, you have to let go. There's only him, though. Right. Cool. I'll get my soul heart back. Could get a key, but I'll go for the, you know, health, you know, the ability to stay alive. That seems good, yeah. A little bit of gold, probably fine. Ouch. The bombs are probably more worth it. Okay, we lost that immediately. Summon. We don't have any regular summons, so we can make this work. Right, let's just get you down. I will use my... Cool, I'm going to use this during this phase. There we go, so now I am invincible. And he has been hit. That did not do much damage. At least to the bosses. Right, what else we got? Okay, Falcon Feather. Uh, weapon upgrade level of weapons that scale with dexterity. Cool, I like that. It's only plus one, but it's not... Yeah, let's go with that one. Plus one up weapon upgrade level. Cool, we have a Falcon. Let's go. Do -do 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 -do. Strength and dex is lovely. Got him. But then the companion just deals with him anyway. More dex. But I definitely like dex weapons, so I'm definitely not going to say no to a falcon that gives me plus 10% extra damage. Okay, fantastic. Some common weapons. Kunai. Double axe. Reinforced. Yep, def definitely the kunai, and it does uh, armor work as well. Is it? Uh, 42. Yeah, definitely more damage. Pawn shot, bit early for that. A key would be nice. It definitely flows slower, but I feel like it's definitely better. Uh, shop. Yeah, we can't really get much from the shop with this little. We can't steal like the other guys could, unfortunately. Nah. 
Let's keep going. Okay, we've got some curse removal. We have a gift box. What's in the gift box? An annoying shield, which I don't want. It's way too heavy. A melee weapon, no. Upgrade, repair, no. We roll. A bomb and a key for a golden chest is actually worth it. Can I end it early? No, not that I can tell. Okay. Blacksmith hammer is... It's, starting with plus two is uh, not awful. Um, deal 1.2 damage per upgrade level 1.4 apparently. Uh, but I don't think... I don't think it's better, especially with its short range. Let's get more decks. I was looking at the uh, Falcon instead of myself for my character. That's not good. Uh, so we have movement speed while near a wall, flowing damage, stamina. Uh, we don't have any gloves. I, figured, I know there's a couple of good dexterity based gloves, so let's hope from that, eh? Oh, I need to remember to dash to gain my Shadow Clones. Shadow Clone Jutsu. And now I can do this. And... Get go. Just survive this phase. Cool. Not the worst. With a companion doing damage while I'm invincible, it's not the worst. Companion attack speed, range damage, critical hit chance. Your attacks gain 25%, but that's only a quiver, which only works with bows and crossbows. 25% chance to trigger light beam. Definitely not awful. Quill hit chance on the offhand, or just range damage. Let's go for the quill hit chance. Let's do it. Strength, intelligence, key. Let's go key. We... Okay, I don't like these guys. These guys suck. <laughs> Alright. Get him. Get him, Falcon. Lovely. Odex. Lovely. Just nice and slow. Just don't get hit and everything's fine. I've never been hit in the end anyway. Buff effect. Best friends forever. See, that gets ruined by my shadow clones, unfortunately. Modifies to your movement speed or supply to your attack speed is not awful. I do like that if you can get super fast movement speed. Let's try that, considering a uh, kind of a uh, build we have. Uh, uncommon weapons, ranged weapon, ranged weapon, guaranteed ranged weapon. Cool. Where are you? I, uh, I had to go underground during the whole thing. At least those guys died. Cool. Come on, give me something good. Give me a legendary. It's no lunch yet. That's a nice one with uh, glacial, which increases the chill effect that it deals. That's fun. Oh, whoa. Cool. <laughs> On attack, 15% chance to trigger the biggest noble ever that deals 2754 to 2400. Nice. That is very fun. Okay, more decks, please. Get chilled. Everybody, chill. Alright, lovely. Um, tavern? Tavern worth it? Is tavern worth it? Probably isn't. Can't use this anymore, unfortunately. Right, what do we got? Alright, come on, Santa. Give me something good. I've been a good boy this year. Armor and mana. Not the worst. Well, that's all she wrote. What's this? Throwing damage. This isn't throwing, which is unfortunate. Moon speed while near a wall. So, and a stamina, so. Uh, we're not doing throwing anymore, so we can take the armor and the mana. Cool. And we've got 10 left. 
20 gold. No, don't have that. Let's get some gold. Do I want a little bit of strength? A little bit of strength is awful. Pew, 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 pew. But with the increased, like, like with the increased kill pack on this weapon, that's really nice. But yeah, we want more stamina, we want more movement speed, so dex is definitely the way to go. More dex. Could get a key, don't need it. But yeah, the movement speed, when we're near a wall, is actually, like, you can actually feel it. It's also going to increase the, the attack speed. Uh, a little bit of soul is not bad. Oh, uh, no. It's giving us a trap door when we don't have a key, the bastard. Uh, we also want lucky hit because of the massive uh, placement thing. But we do have that with our decks. So. Get me in. Blow it up. Um, boots, offhand. What I'm really looking for is gloves. Accessories, not bad though. Alright, let's go. I am now invincible. You cannot hit me. I am now invincible. You can never hit me. I think... Can I attack during that? I don't know. I haven't been. Alright, cool. That's one. Alright, let's go. Yeah, no, you can't. Get him. Whoa! <laughs> That's brilliant. Got very lucky with those. It doesn't mean like I can't see what's coming towards me, but you know, what are you gonna do? That's cruel hit chance. I was hoping that was gonna be like a chill one. Poison duration. Icy orbital that uh, deals cold damage. Uh, critical hit chance per weapon upgrade level. It's plus two. Um, let's go for the chill kind of build. I don't care for the armor or the mana from this, so... Yeah, it's cool. Uh, where are we going? We did evil last time, so law or good. Let's try law. Intelligence, mana recovery, magic. What is this? This does work a little bit on intelligence, so let's go for intelligence and mana recovery so we can run through things more but I'm not taking I mean it's that's like a very cheap one so I guess it's not the worst for very cheap getting a morality it's worth it let's go more decks means more luck means more movement speed whoa 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 what the hell Oh, okay, well, I'm with epic weapons. Guess I'm not sticking with this then. Uh, cold damage from a skull wand. Uh, we know the Tinker Top is good. On cooler hits, we Pete's next attack. Again, 100% quick chance with Pete's. Disintegration way. And the Paper Bomb Kunai is very much uh, the uh, ninja's kind of upgrade route with the explosion. Not being refreshed for one second. Yeah. Disintegration. Cold damage. Let's go with disintegration. Pew pew. Yep, give me two soul hearts. That's lovely. I thought this would attack faster, to be honest. I guess it makes sense. This integration is quite strong. This thing's dead. Give me a soul heart. Two soul hearts. And give me the event over the soul heart. Are they keys to meet me? Worthy in dexterity. Yippee. Drank. Unworthy. Unworthy. I think it's like. Yep, unworthy. That's fine. Plus three decks. Not bad at all. Alright, uh, shop. No, bombs. We don't have the ability to steal. So what's the point in going to a shop if you can't steal things? Cool. Um, tavern. Nah, I'm gonna 
consumables. Need a pawn shop at this point, because the inventory is very full of stuff that we don't want to keep. Okay, that's plus one dex. That's not bad. Dex and intelligence is good. Uh, give me a random thing. Close range weapon upgrade level. No. Use that to refresh that. Don't have any curse. Uh, take that over that. Uh, we're definitely doing this though. Let's go, ninja. Yeah, if we death, we'll get ninjas out, which will give us a lethal hit chance. Which will do more damage the lower they are on health. Cool. Give me a level up. What are we gonna get? Intelligence increases that. Modifier to lucky hit chance also applies for your critical hit damage. That's 120% currently. Uh, up at 100%, up to 250. Yes, that's very good. Oh look, it's Event Horizon. Yeah, we're not doing that. But that worked very well with this. So, our lucky hits are now going to increase our critical hit damage and the critical hits and the lucky hits themselves will increase the chance to get critical hits to happen. Accessory. Cool. Let's go. Damn. Get one of them out I guess. Cool. One down. Okay. Activate. I thought it lasted longer to be honest. Dead. Yeah. In the shadows, what have we got? Companion capacity, on dash gain haste. I mean, that's not awful, but this is definitely better. Because then we can get another one of those. And now we have extra upgrade level. Cool, which is just an extra 10% damage. Cool, moving on. Fever. Yeah, go on. Uh, let's go for more stamina. And let's go for more decks. Our attack speed should go up, like, really quickly because the decks is going to give us attack speed and move speed, as you can see from that. But yeah, we'll get an extra 0.5 uh, attack speed. So we should have it really fast. Again. Cursed meat chain? I don't think so. Thank you. Cool. More decks, absolutely. Just gonna absolutely get as much dexterity as possible. Dodging. Like the world depends on it. Oh, this is a 30... I don't need it. I do need to clear my inventory. That was probably a stupid idea, because, like, I could sell this at any point, really. But I do want to clear my inventory to get the cash so I can actually get other things and uh, then to improve my build. Snowball Cannon was very fun. I would have liked to use that for longer. Unfortunately, it's just been outclassed. Uh, definitely get rid of the magic damage one. That's so sad. That's so sad. That's gotta go. Uh, cool hit chance we can keep. Stamina we keep. Movement speed my new wall we keep. Yep, yeah, all of these we keep. I feel bad for keeping this one now, because the other one's definitely better. Oh well. Uh, a little bit of strength, I guess. Uh, okay, you know, we go for a little bit of strength. Can make a bit of difference. Everything's dead. Um, armor, more armor. Sure. We uh, give up on the heart, we get some armor. That's cool. 
And there's also... I don't know, I don't think it, was, it would have been possible to get both of those. Well, we have got, got sick iron with a whetstone. What's the... Yep, yeah, plus two, plus three. Cool. Let's get some gold. No point in wasting a bomb on the... Cool. On the strength. Gloves. Still need gloves. Alright, let's do it. I'm gonna wait until the second phase. Use the thing. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see if we got. And I'm invincible. And it does barely nothing. Barely nothing? Yeah, barely nothing. Barely anything. Alright, we have plus one mana, we have cat ears, we have dark damage, we have plus one dexterity. No, like, I'm not even going to think about that. Like, it's just, that's clearly the best one. Right, we want some intelligence now. But yeah, because that increases our attack speed by a lot. Um, we need a little bit more here. Uh, damage close range, magic find, one of the feet of Yep, magic find, thank you. Now we've got all the lawful we need. Fantastic. Dexterity up, strength down. I don't think it's worth. Let's get a key. It's definitely more worth now that it's plus two instead of plus one. But still not worth going for. Wear weapons, no. We can take a curse blessing because we have a curse removal. Cool. Uh, poison duration, radiant damage to attacks, or just plus five intelligence. Radiant damage is very good because of the uh, lucky hits we have. I believe, I believe it's extra damage with lucky hits. And because we're going to be getting a bunch with this, which we're already at 105%, that's going to increase the uh, sort of our damage with lucky hits, which is just going to increase the damage overall. Couple of mimics there. A bunch of weapons I don't want. I was hoping for like a. Uh, so we have the Bariza, which deals cold damage for dexterity trait. Trying to, it's really trying to make me get get back to that. Uh, we have the electric incinerator. We have the a cold damage there as well. We have rupture on the same as katana. The incinerator's not awful. We can try it for one, or we could just sell it. Honestly, I don't need to sell yet, so we can uh, go for. I don't really want a potion though either. Uh, golden chest, yeah, sure. Definitely a strong weapon, this. Yep. Uh, ooh! Enigma armor, definitely taking that. Two weapon upgrade level, plus two magic find, fantastic. And also plus two armor as well, which is lovely. Uh, more dex, I guess. Doesn't hurt. But we do. We are looking for the intelligence. I mean, I might just go for this. What's this? I mean, we still need intelligence if we're going for that. Turn down to plus burn damage. Definitely, like... Damn. I didn't realise that. It's pretty good. Um, shop. Flask. No. Oh, I need to use my curse removal. Uh, no, nothing. Hello, friend. Can I steal your cheese again? Um, nah. Ooh, blood chest. Yeah, the burn does insane damage. The problem, the only problem really, is that the uh, range is a lot lower. Dexterity and strength. More dexterity, which, yeah, each of that increases our strength. We have plus 20 of it, so it's like... That's nice. Far range. Every four seconds, trigger your on-dash effects. Hey, it's a wagger! It's on tick. Um, what other on-dash effects do we have? Because I know we've got our... Uh, Shin uh, ninja Shadow Warriors, but does anything else activate? 
I don't think so. That's uh, it's been a while since I've seen Swagger. That's who you are. Buff effect. Does that affect like what counts as a buff? Does that count as a buff? Does that count as a buff? Does that count as a buff? Because I think it's the only things that show up next to your character sheet, I think. Uh, attack speed also affect tick speed. Really works well with the burn damage. Um, yeah, let's do that. Okay. Um, offhand, definitely can get better offhand. Absolutely melted. Yep, yeah, this is this is the white pool. Hey, oi, there we go. Cool. Woo! Deep in the shadows. Let's use that. All right, what do we got? Bow and crossbow attacks can't you? I don't have a bow or crossbow. Damage over time on body armor. No, we're not getting rid of that one. Dexterity additionally grants your attacks to a peat over the plus one level is probably better. And this is body armor. Yeah, take this. Because that's just giving me like 10%. This will give me, um, uh, for each point, like more, like more shots, which is more damage overall, like 50% or so. Yeah, modifies to your attack speed, also play to tick speed, and we already have insane attack speed so that's good to me brilliant this is a really just is just a really strong dexterity synergy one more dex more dex because that's good it's like it won't scale the weapon anymore but it is going to uh increase the burn damage and increase the chance for attacks to appear and uh, critical hit uh, damage and lucky hit chance. Yep. Movement speed, uh, attack speed. Yep. It's beautiful. Yeah, look at this. I think it's worth getting rid of a strength for it now. Yeah, we're not worried about our. Uh, I mean, technically, um. This does also do damage over time, because it's tick. So it's not like awful. Like this isn't awful if you're trying to kill things from far away. But the burn damage on this being increased is what gives it the edge. Uh, flask refill? Um, sure. Might as well stay top class on that just in case. We do want to get uh, at least one. Um, Food, uh, not food, uh, armor repair. Cheese. It's cheese to meet you. Dexterity, please. Um, maximum tipsiness, we're not using. We don't need a flask. Strength and dex, I would like, but this is a 30 soul worth item. So we're going to take that over, give me some more safety. Gives me a better safety net. Tavern, lovely. What have we got? Uh, you've got a luck potion, which is very good. That's definitely worth it. Oh, definitely taking the strength on the decks because we do want to get our, uh, um, our strength and intelligence up because that will increase the scaling of the burn and also our main weapon. Could get some beer. Uh, critical hit damage. Critical hit damage. If only I had sold all my stuff so I had more money. Tequila. Yeah, I'll just spend all my money on tequila. Sure. Right, are we at three? Yeah, max three. Cool. Strength and depth. Beautiful. Summon. We could get a better better summon. This is plus one, which is not awful. Uh, yeah, we can't really get a better uh, chest plate, so that's good. Red dragon, die to my fire. 
Not even, like, not even giving him a second to think about it. Who needs to use the skills when, like, the main weapons are this strong? Tick speed. Ooh, not bad. Critical hit damage. Also not bad. Damage per mana container. Kind of bad. Poison damage. Eh. Tick speed is very good for the damage over time stuff. Critical hit damage is also good with all the critical hits we are doing. But I think what would be better? Because we're already at 525 critical hit damage. And that will... I've got other ways to increase that. Tick speed itself is harder to increase. Wait, no, what am I talking about? Attack speed also increases in ticks. Tick speed. I mean, it's whatever. Tick speed is tick speed is tick speed. We have one of them. Beep, 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 beep. Very good. Yeah, 55% chance for attack, attack, attack exterior. Uh, upgrade. Uh, repeat. Um, told weapon, nope. Bit late for that, my friend. Skill effect, no. I really like, like, I really want to try out the skills more, uh, when I can, but it's just like, like, uh, it's, it's easier to, uh, just build, it, 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 it's not worth building around them. Uh, well, at least some of them, like, some of them are stronger than others, some of them are definitely really good, like the deprived one, that we obviously know is fantastic. Soul hurt, thank you, more death, thank you. But something like this, it just doesn't, uh... Ah, no key. And the keys are cursed. Ah, you absolute. That's so mean. That's so mean. Dex and Intelligence definitely were... That was mine, not yours. Don't worry about it. Thought I had that. Oh. Quill hit chance per dex. I'm sorry, I've already got enough quill. Well, I mean, technically, we don't actually have. Uh, I thought I had. I mean, I have high lucky hit chance, not high critical hit chance. But yeah, that's actually gonna. Because 47, and then it will double roll with the lucky hit chance. Yeah. So, definitely work. Um. Sure, random consumables. I need a pawn shop again. Because I gave up on that one earlier, but now I definitely need it. More decks. Shop. Keys. Bomb. Secret room. Dragon Slayer, Greatsword. It's fun, but not what we're going for, especially since there aren't that many dragons left. Execution of Sword, we can drop. It's worth less. We're not worthless, just worth less. Uh, let's go for the double key so we're not running out of keys. We don't have that much cash. Ooh, Soul Forge. If I'm sticking with this one, yes, absolutely. Oh, I thought I had more. Right, no, because it's all coming from this. No, plus three. Where's all the levels coming from? I mean, I can still do this. Plus four. Plus five. Plus six. There we go, lovely. That's gonna give us a little bit more damage. Cool. Uh, potion, infusion, let's go for... Neither. Strength. So that will still increase the scaling. Legendary weapon, lovely. What are we at? 6 out of 10, 7 out of 10. And we've got a million. Alright, lovely. I wonder if that hit him, that would have uh, done the damage picks. Alright, one down. And another one down. Lovely. Whee! What do you got? If you have 4 points of good, I do not. Uh, two, no, not worth it. No. 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 Alright, time to re-roll! Uh, ruthless hits, no. Melee, no. Lucky hit chance, no. I mean, I don't really want the mana recovery, I'll take the lucky hit chance. That's all worthless. 
All right, let's do it. Intelligence, fantastic. Because like nothing's going to beat the plus 20 dexterity with all of the bonuses we get from dexterity. Cool. Everything dies. Uh, golden chest. We can blow it up. Floor nine here. So we're reaching the end. Money. Epic weapon. No, honestly, just... Okay, yep, yeah, more decks. Sounds good. I just need stats, yeah. Honestly, I'm surprised I'm not max level yet with all the stats I've been getting. Strength up intelligence down is not really what I want, but I guess it's fine. Cool. Also, is it just me or is the mana stuck? Pawn shop, finally. It's not going over the over to the third one. Panic capacity we can drop. Dragon Slayer Swords we can drop. Yep. Uh, I do need to use them. Cool. And drop the Kaskatana. Drop the Ruiza. Uh, drop the Falcon Feather, I guess. Because we don't get anything, I mean, yeah, it would only give us plus 10%, but as a tick speed gives us more damage. Disintegration, we appreciate you, because you were very good early. I need a hat better hat. I mean, it's plus one stamina, it's hard to beat that. Uh, cool hit chance, definitely good to keep. Uh, any of these down here, dexterity, intelligence, uh, lucky hit chance, magic find. They're all kind of, un they're all uncommons, but they're all very good, so... Let's go for more Mimics, just to fill out my inventory with the more useless stuff. What do we got? So, we have the Lance and the Contaminated Trident, not awful. And then we have a bunch of potions. I'll take that one and I'll save these ones for the later floors. More Dexterity. So much, so much bonus from the Dexterity. Cool. It wouldn't have been awful to say uh, keep the uh, disintegration wave for like if I had to kill something far away. But I don't think that's not worth doing, but it's definitely something we could have done. Stack of Shock additionally grants critical hit damage taken. That is actually good because I believe that that will work. I believe it's only the effect of Shock itself that doesn't work. I believe because this does lightning damage that will do extra critical damage because it will, in fact, it will give the shock. Let's go for a rare item. And that should increase the critical heart hit damage, which is, yep, still gonna, we're all doing full hits. That's beautiful right there. That's lovely. So quick. I could speed on this if I wanted to, but. Level four or higher, inflict corruption, which is, increases the dark damage taken, which we're not doing. Invincibility, no, because this is just a repeat, which is incredibly good. Power, I mean, nothing really good here. Yeah, that's not great. Evil shop, might as well have a look. Attack speed, power per point of good. In the evil shop? How's it going, man? Mm hmm, mm hmm, sure. Damage against bosses, power of good, attack speed. Attack speed isn't awful. But, um, uh, actually, yeah, nah, it's 15 souls, that's not worth it. Let's go for a favor. We have enough health, so we're going to go for you. I'm going to use this and uh, just use it once, because I feel like it's definitely not worth using, because it doesn't do much damage late in the game. There we go, it changed to two. We just need to fix thing. It's definitely invincibility, which uh, could be helpful. Uh, curse? No. Double you? Yeah, go on. Double mimic. Cool. Lots of money. Uh, power shard, which doesn't do anything, unfortunately. Uh, flash repair arm was not interesting. Power also increasing mana recovery. None of these are interesting. And honestly, I don't see any point of picking them up. 
more strength does help me out a tiny bit with the scaling on this weapon. Uh, shop. No bombs. Oh, no bombs is actually really rough. And no rerolls. I guess we'll go here. No bombs means I can't explode. Ah! Uh... Oh. Whoa, Ragnarok. On the tally of 50 attacks, took his Ragnarok. Hold up, what does that mean? What does that mean? Also, this just press that, which is not awful, but... I've got very fast attack speed. Yeah, you can see in the corner there, there's Ragnarok there. Okay, um... We're not going to be sticking with this one, but I do want to see what it does. Activate Ragnarok. Oh, it's Apocalypse. Fantastic. Time to fight Thor, I guess. That's fun. Last a while, too. I could just activate that constantly. Soul Heart. Soul, so, not Soul Hearts, just Souls. Uh, we do have a giant chest chest, and we do have a key fall, which is lovely. I've got so much stuff, though. There it goes. Because I can just... I can get it all the way up to, like, 40, and then wait. Alright, give me something good. Right, what have we got? It's 3 plus 2, so I will be able to use that on it. There we go. Just a tiny bit. Um, what have we got? We have just how fast we attack. Top hat, rocket boots. What's uh move speed when near a wall on dash gain speed boost. Yep, that's good. Yep. That's gonna increase our attack speed as well. I'm literally just like it's hard I know it's hard to see it at the bottom left. Companions are equal to yours. Uh what is my companion? My companion is currently the snail. But it's an offhand and we do have high critical, so. Uh, it's a little bit lower, but it shouldn't matter. Lightning damage to melee and ranged attacks. Yeah, sure, go on. We are a little above the limit, unfortunately. Just need... Ah, uh, oh, no, and this is the last one where we can get strength as well. Ah, oh, that's so frustrating. That's plus five. That's plus five, so that wouldn't make a difference. It's only this. I mean, we're already doing lightning, so I guess it really doesn't matter. But I want to keep it because it's it's the Valkyrie helmet. All right, um, let's boogie. Uh, I think. Do I want to grab any of this? No. Let's move on. All right. Now I wish I take I took that on dash one because that speed boost is nice. There's a golden stake that does that. Oh yes, you're right. Correct. I just completely like forgot about that. Alright, uh, I guess we're going this way. Hello. You need to die? No, you need to die. Enough. Uh, no, enough of you. <laughs> really? Oh, look, Mithra. That's from Panion Per Arm Container. I mean, that would just. Uh, no, that's not worth it. Uh, that's a bit late, and shock additionally does 10% damage roll per stack, no. We take that, we move on. Awesome. We're actually doing less damage because we've lost a lot of, uh, where are we going? We're going lawful to the Shadow Plains. Let's do it, Chaos and Mayhem. Good times, good times. Right, it's been a bit. We're gonna gain a favor. More dashes, so we can speed boost more. Alright. It keeps giving me that third mana star. That doesn't fill. It's interesting. Attack speed is good. Increases a bunch of other stuff as well. This is definitely better, but Ragnarok is very funny. 
Oh, max health. More max health. Lovely. Just getting lucky here. Grants a blessing. Absolutely. We definitely don't need non-critical damage. I'll tell you that right now. Cool. Damage non-critical. As I said, we don't need non-critical. Attack speed. That's a bug? Yeah, I guess. Known bug. Okay, cool. As long as it's known, we don't have to worry about it. Cool. Is it... Uh... Cool. Everything's dead. And equip our capacity. This, after this, like, we're just going to speed up like an insane amount. Yum. And the literally... Look at that. It's literally a full barrage. 50 seconds and like, 50 hits and like what? Like, one, two, three, four, maybe four seconds. Incredible. Let's go find the infusion. Thing is, I am. Uh, it doesn't. <laughs> Cold damage, I guess. Was the movie also thinking about getting rid of the uh, infusions as well? I can't remember if we were talking about that. And it actually works. Everything dies. <laughs> this is good. Because if they get set on fire, they just get absolutely murdered because of the tick. I don't even need to switch to this one to get the increased burn damage. Uh, curse. Don't want to curse. Don't have a thing, so we just go here. As long as it- oh, That was way too close. Dragon what? Does it actually say? Here we go. Every 0.07 seconds triggers no dealing. 10 to 1044 lightning or 10 to 1044 fire damage. Yeah, so it's lightning and fire. Which is what we've already got, which is brilliant. Alright. Oh, we're already here. Gloves. Set item. Set item. Can't be well anything, so here we go. Hello. Who? Gary on. That's who you are. Sorry, I was about to ask, who are you again? <laughs> Just an absolute insult to injury. Yeah, this doesn't scale with death, but I don't think we have to worry about that. Nah. Nah. Can't just live that. Ayo, Justin, check. How's it going, Ayo, Justin, check? <laughs> I forgot that that's just your name on here. Oh, uh, we just killed that guy. We want to see Ragnarok. There's Ragnarok. I want to see it again. It's just all the Ragnarok. <laughs> Love the check. Oh, amazing. We don't need to grab anything. I'm not even gonna bother looking. We don't need it. I'm a ninja who's uh, who's um, causing Ragnarok. Uh, that's that's fun, isn't it? We're going. Why did you just say your name? <laughs> right, because he just said his name. Yep, I get it now. <laughs> My brain just completely shut off there. All right, here we go. Uh, I guess this fine. And death from above. There's actually a chance it does like no damage technically. I don't think we have to worry about that. Let's grab all these. Ten wounds. Should last till the end room now. Beautiful. Why did it add an axe? I have no idea. Um Oh, I don't think it did. I think that's just a on your end. Uh, cool hit chance. No, highest attribute. More dex. More speed. More tick speed. More depth. More depth. More tick speed. More depth. More passion. More energy. Definitely trigger. No. Ah, oh, trigger damage would have made amazing. I uh, guess boost is fine. Guess we'll just get drunk instead. Hit that clock. Movement speed is very good. Malt footwork, exactly. 
because that's also going to increase our attack speed. <laughs> Insane. Yeah, that's actually plus 20%. Uh, that's brilliant. Okay. It resets it so it keeps going. Brilliant. Yeah. Uh, let's get a key, I guess. Hello, would you like to talk about what you said? You're wearing a wall. Oh, I'm over here now. Lucky hit chance. Yeah, sure, that will do. No, because uh, this will give us lucky hits as well as everything else it gives us. Is everything dead yet? I say footwork, I get footwork, yep. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of potion, sure. I mean, it might just give me something we already have, but... Like, this, like, let's not, let's not say no to, like, this thing. This thing has been with us for a long time and is still amazing. But, Vagnot's just like, like, you can see this thing just melts. But did you see the... so many numbers? The crit damage is insane. William. Alright, here we are, we made it. Um we don't really need anything here. I guess we can repair our armor. Yippee! Well, this has been an amazing one. Ragnarok. Electric incinerator. Enigma armor. Valkyrie helmet. So many legendaries. Uh, dexterity, dexterity gives us a chance to repeat. Dexterity also increases our luck hit chance. Which also increase, uh, uh, increases our movement speed, which increases our attack speed. Increase our lucky hit chance, and d it then goes into our critical hit damage up to 150. Uh, each tackle shock, which we're dealing with the electric attacks, also uh, increases the critical hit damage. Uh, we have increased critical hit chance for each dexterity trait, and modifies to my attack speed, also applied to my tick speed, which works on the Ragnarok effect and the burn effect as well. We have plus 20 dexterity there on dash gain speed boost, which will increase our attack speed. We also have a couple of additional charms and so many buffs. Brilliant. So this is going to be fun. He's not going to last more than, I'm going to say, about 10 seconds. Hello, Durf. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. All right, let's start off with Ragnarok. And... Yep, yeah, that feels good. If I get here, I don't care. I think... We've also got so much health and so many potions. And then just finish him off with the incinerator. And he's gone. It's, it's over. Uh, I have... I have completed the game. I have finished the game. The game is over, everyone go home. No wait, stay! No, stay! <laughs> Amazing, what a run! Beautiful one. Can I make Ragnarok appear here? <laughs> die! Die! Die, my loyal subjects, die! Amazing. Well, thank you for watching everybody. You've made it all the way to the end and you saw that. I'm glad you stayed with me because that was awesome. Absolutely incredible. Uh, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more of this. Get smited, exactly. A new master! Yes, that's me. Yippee! Spice this, huh? Oh, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Those four things help me help out the channel. Show you want you want to see more of this. It also helps this. Vi it helps out the channel in general, and also this video specifically. Uh, you can also join us on the Discord if you just want to chat, hang out. It's pretty chill. You just talk about games you like, that kind of thing. You can make your own form from the game you like. I did that because I thought it was fun. Um, and the Twitch, we're Friday, Saturday, 5 p.m. Uh, GMT BST. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.